What is up, YouTube? Gaming here. Hope everyone is doing excellent today. As always, so am I. So today, uh, I think we're going to start to get into the blue production. The blue bottle science pack production. And hopefully get that started today. Uh, there is a couple of more things that I want to do around here. Just a little bit. I want to get this iron circled around get it connected back over here so that it's coming in and uh, feeding all this because I've noticed that there's a little bit of a slowdown of production right here because we're not getting enough iron plates over here and then I also want to get one more set of each of these down here a little bit more so let's go ahead and get that taken care of real quick Then I also want to reroute where the green bottles go, or how they go up. Let me see here. I know I've got some. I need to clean up my inventory some as well. What are those? What are those? What are those? Make another one of these. All right. Get a couple more of these, a couple more of these. Get this rerouted back down here. There we go. Good to go there. Uh, let's go ahead and get these furnaces upgraded. Last episode we researched how to make the steel furnaces. And I got a little bit of steel crafting off camera. Just for that purpose. I'm going to throw some more in here. Oh, need some more iron. Let's go grab some. Ain't got much in here grab up all this Gonna make four of those bad boys real quick let's see here throw 50 in each one of these that should be good for the moment and replace these there we go a lot more production now, hopefully. These are much faster than the other ones. And then, I think I'm also going to want to... Oh, research time. Let's go ahead and get the bigger tool belt. That'll help out a lot. Also going to want to extend these out. One more each. Get this ran down here oh too far there we go and that one there 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 and there there we go for some power good to go there Got that all set up. Let's go ahead and run the green how I wanted to get it done. Um, let's set this up first. And there we go. And 
this down here. Oh, wrong way. There we go. Maybe. If I can start placing stuff correctly, that might be pretty awesome. want that there. Move all this center stuff real quick. That way none of it's in my way. Just place down what we have to have. There's all of that. Put this bad boy back. Over here, I believe I want it like that. There, and remove this one and put him there. There we go. That's gooder. few more of those. We're going to want more iron as well. As you can see, our iron production is definitely ramped up, which is a good thing. We're going to want all the iron. this ram properly. There we go. All of it connected up. Just run over here. guys right here. Oh, more research. So let's take a look. Um, in order to make blue bottles, what we're going to need is battery, vent circuits, smart inserters, and steel plates. Uh, still, we've already got. Uh, we just need to start automation of that. Uh, the smart inserters aren't too bad. Let's see what we need to make those. Smart inserters. We need one fast inserter and four electric circuits. And then for the fast inserter, we need two electronic circuits and iron plate and inserters. So that's not too bad. We, we got everything we need for that. Um, let's see what else. Adv 
advanced circuits. In order to make advanced circuits, we're going to need two electronic circuits, plastic bars, and copper cable. So let's check out plastic. For plastic, we're going to need coal and petroleum. In order to get petroleum up and running, we're going to need oil. So let's go ahead. I believe I want to go ahead and get the oil process started. Yeah. Let's get the oil started. Now we have a nice fancy dancy new toolbar down here. Do all kinds of stuff with this thing. I love it. That there. Help us organize just a little bit better. This right there, this right there, let me see here, don't need that, don't need that, and let's go ahead and put this here, that there, that should be good for right now, I've got a little junk chest right here, let's go ahead and make a steel one, there we go, much larger, and just dump everything in here, Real quick, just take out what I want. Let's grab a couple of those, this, all of that, that, and that should be good for the moment. Sorry, I was just checking how much time the video had on it. Make sure we don't go over today. Or at least I'm going to try not to. No promises, though. Okay, so over here, what we're going to do is once we get this set up and the iron production's good there, we're going to want the steel production going and I'm going to use electric furnaces for the steel production and we're going to feed off of this side and then we'll also have the iron running along the other side as well so that we can get that uh, I need a 3x3 three three. let's go ahead and just make one of these real quick we're going to need tons of these later so it doesn't hurt to go ahead and make one now and then so the electric furnaces are a 3x3 three instead of the 2x2 two two for the regular furnaces and the steel furnaces. And what I think I'm going to do is just have them lined up just like this on either side. I want to make one more of those. I need just a bit more iron. Run all the way down here. Grab that up. Come on. There we go. So I'm going to have them set up just like this with the steel outputting right here on either side and then the iron inputting on either side there and there and then I'll just have it going down just like that and I think four of them should be pretty good for what we're going to want. But I'm going to give myself just a little bit more room, just in case it's not. In case I want to expand out some. That should be good right there. That there. Throw that there. There, there we go. Yeah, that should be pretty good. And then... Let me see here. Uh, I want to go ahead and split this off. Yeah, right there should be good. Go ahead and split it right there. Run this. 
it down to here and over. Oh, ran out of ran out of conveyors. Pick these up. Don't need them there anymore. There we go. And then I'm gonna do the same thing for the copper as well. So let's go ahead and line this up really nice and good right there. This will do a couple things for us. Now, instead of having these chests here, oh, research time, uh, we are going to want fluid handling. Uh, basically, we can't hold fluid or the oil in any containers or the byproducts of the oil in any containers other than these big tanks. So that's definitely what we're going to want is these. So let's go ahead and get... Oh, no, that's not what I want. I want this here. Almost took the, out the green. Oh, that's right. I need to finish running that up. That reminds me. There we go. Get that there. I can take all this out now. We don't need it anymore. That there to there. That there. There we go. Got that ran properly. Got all that ran. I'm gonna go ahead and throw a splitter down right here. This will help run that. Uh, and as I've seen, now we don't need these chests sitting right here at the end of that line because we can have them up here now. I'll go ahead and place them back. That's that. And I'm going to place a fast one right there now. Do the same for the iron. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Get it powered. Awesome. Alright. Let's come on back down here. And then where we were. Oh, this needs to be connected up. That's what the hold up is. There we go. Excellent. Alright. Done. Done. We need steel. So let's go ahead. Ooh, we don't have any of that. Some more. Some more stone. Iron. 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 throw this access copper in here. Because I don't need it on me. And I should be able to make at least two of these. That'll get our steel production going. Might not be much, but it'll be something. Steel production is a go. Oh, wait, needs coal. That's not that big. Oh, it looks like our iron is starting to take quite the hit. 
Okay, we'll get that fixed. Um, let me just get some coal real quick. Oh, I got a whole bunch over here, I think. Oh, no, I lied. It's all stone. That's fine. I've got a whole bunch of it up here. Good. Then we'll get our iron sorted out. Just need a couple more drills over there so that I can keep up with the production that we're doing at the moment. Just gonna throw one there, there, and there. That way, that one will get powered up that way, that, and those two will be powered up there. Just run it straight up. Let's go ahead and get a splitter on here, because I know it's going to want one. There we go. Excellent day. I also want to get a splitter over here as well. There we go. Excellent. Alright. Now we have our first bits of steel. Excellent. stacks of iron. Now, let's get our oil situation taken care of. What am I missing? The steel. Alright, or the oil production is going to require a lot of steel. So is the, uh, the next science pack as well. Okay, it looks like these two are probably our best bet. I'll go ahead and get another one of those making. We are also going to want one of these in which we're going to want more stone for. So I'll get some of that cooking up if we don't already have some. Two stacks should be good. Do I have enough iron? Yeah. Get a stack in there. Alright, can't quite get that one going yet, but that's fine. Let's head on over here and see how what kind of damage we can do on this side. There's that. And then we're gonna want a few of those. And quite a few of those. That's going to take a minute or two to make up. In the meantime, let's head on down here. Uh, what we're going to want over here is that there. That there. Uh, soak up some of those. So this one is going to be our, oh, yay. So for batteries, what's next on the list? Going to want to make, let's go ahead and get sulfur researched. So this one is going to be for our fast inserters and this one is going to be our smart inserter, except we're going to need one of these there. We're going to want three of those all together. Also going to want to run all three of these and all three of these down here as well. So, how do I want to get that ran? Go ahead and remove that. That run just like that. That should be good. Do the same thing on this side. There we go. That shouldn't 
interrupt production too terribly much. Let's remove all of these. Get these moved as well. Move the power lines. Alright, so the fast or the long handed inserters gonna want there, there, and there. Yes. Then switch that around there, there, there. And we are going to want to extract those. Nope, we're gonna want fast inserters for that. Go ahead and make a couple more of those. That, that, that. Then one, two, one more. Come on. There we go. Three. the cable and run that there grab a couple of these run that there to there 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 that should be good there to there to there to there excellent and let's get the rest of them powered shall we That looks like a good spot for that one, and there's a good spot for that one. Excellent. Got all that taken care of. Pop that down there. And then these two right here. Let's go ahead and move these over a couple. There we go. And then these are going to be our uh, red circuits. This one's set up to be the fast inserter. So in order to make a fast inserter, we're going to want electronic circuits, iron plate, and an inserter. Well, good thing we already have inserter production right here. So all we need to do is get the inserter production down to here. And that shouldn't be too terribly hard. Let's get a long inserter, place it right there. And then we already have the circuits right here, so we just need to run them down. And that there, and put that there. Yeah, that should be good. this underneath here and it'll automatically connect up there there we go we have circuits and we have those Is that? I think that's how I had it ran been doing a little bit of testing in uh, just off camera just to see how I want everything ran see how everything runs and works just to make sure I have the most efficient setup possible. Let me take a look here. Oh man, we got lots of steel now. Let's go ahead and pick this up. Looks like it's actually the old wrapping up point. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a couple more things uh, researched off camera. All I'm going to research off camera is I'll get the sulfur processing 
uh, finished I'll go ahead and do the plastics and then I'll also get the batteries researched as well that way y'all don't have to wait around for that and that should be taken care of and then I will see y'all next time take it easy